Hello everybody. Okay, today I'm going to go over the final form of the ski erg that I put together. So for those of you that watched the previous episode regarding the ski erg, this isn't a lot different. I just made a couple of little tweaks. And this one doesn't so much use the rack, but it could be set up on absolutely any chin-up bar other than maybe the temporary ones that you hang over like door frames and things like that, but any chin-up bar that's installed. So, how is this one different? Or let's just go over the whole thing from beginning to end. All right, so down at the bottom, I've got weight on these loading pins, and then also attached to the loading pins is a heavy chain that goes all the way over to a blue strap that's wrapped around a dumbbell. And that's so that these things kind of stay controlled. The chains don't flop around too much in directions I don't want them to flop around to. Now, as we go up, I wanted to mount this as high as possible so I could get my hands up way high. The way the Concept 2 people do this is their hands are just a little bit over their heads, but the way the CrossFitters do this, they kind of extend their arms as far as possible. So I wanted this as high as possible, so I put it on my multi-grip bar, but you know, mount it to your chin-up bar. Uh, with any luck, your chin-up bar is high up off the floor. And then I wanted the pulleys to be high, so I went with these mini rescue pulleys attached to carabiners. And then down here I've got a strap that's wrapped around the end of this cable. And I tried to make the strap relatively short-ish. Now, I know that on the new version of the Ski Erg, they don't have straps, and they've got a kind of elaborate-shaped handle. If you want to shop and get that handle, fine, whatever. I mean... I don't see that as really, that's more of a chocolate and vanilla issue. I don't see that as really affecting the way this thing works. So that's it. I've just got these pulleys uh, attached up high on my chin-up bar. And then I've got a couple straps that I use here as handles. Cables go down to the loading pins. So this is a heavy chain. This would be a really heavy, high-resistance workout, but I'll show you how it looks. So hey, it's noisy and it's not a perfect analog, but I feel like you can kind of get the same workout. I've got, again, heavy chains attached here. I would maybe use the lighter chains, like the connecting chains or something like that for something more like a typical ski erg experience. Also, obviously, you're not getting any of the electronics, so maybe you could do this with a Tabata timer or something like that if you wanted to, just run your Tabata timer and do these sessions. So. The thing with a ski erg is they're expensive and they take up a lot of room. So if you've got a lot of room and a lot of money, go ahead and do that. But maybe, you know, maybe you're a CrossFitter or something that wants to be ready for your next ski erg session. This is, you know, this is going to, it's going to work. It's going to exercise exactly the same muscles. I, I'm working up just a tiny bit of sweat from doing this for a few minutes. So it's an option. I think that really this is pretty viable. So again, uh, not really that different than the last thing I did on a ski erg, but this is sort of the final form. This is the way I would use it if I were going to go ahead and, and do some exercises with it. So if you need an inexpensive ski erg and all you have is the money for some pulleys, loading pins, use the weights and the chains you already have, typical weight room equipment, then you can get ski erg functionality. Um, if you've got the money and space and you want an actual ski erg, then you know what, go for it. So that's all I got for you. Have a great day, everybody. I hope you have a fantastic workout and we'll see you soon. Alexa, start Sergeant Tabata. Which would you like? A standard Tabata, a custom Tabata, or help? Standard Tabata. Starting a Tabata with eight rounds, each with 20 seconds work and 10 seconds rest. Ready, set, work. Round two, ready, set, work.